kind of just how do i can say i did this video this is the next day so basically what y'all gonna see me do is kind of organize what i got last night and actually i think i'm gonna go ahead and count in what i got on wednesday night so i did actually work wednesday surprisingly i think i actually made a little bit more no i don't remember i'm about to go get that money and then i'll be right back so i got wednesday's night wednesday night money i got last night's money and then we'll go back to work tonight. So there will be a part, I guess three, technically, for day three. So what I ended up doing was I was going to bring y'all along and I was going to actually do a come with me to work. And then I kind of realized that last night got super busy and I wasn't able to record. Wednesday, okay, so let me tell y'all what happened. Wednesday was so boring that it was no point of recording. Last night got so busy that it was too complicated to record. So I did end up recording the jar a little bit like as the night went on. And I did it Wednesday. I recorded the jar from last night. Um, me sorting the money as usual. And then um, like organizing my money. Organizing the house fees. Organizing the everything. Whatever. I can't even remember. So that's what I did last night. So today I thought it would be just a little bit better for me to kind of chit chat and organize the money and do like one of the little money counts that i haven't done in like forever so if y'all have been following me along on this journey um i don't know if y'all do know don't know but i do still work or i do work at i still work at a strip club that's my part-time job i work now i only work two days a week because we kind of altered our hours for winter hours so our winter hours we are no longer open on mondays which is totally fine. I actually am going to count it separate and then add it together. Because I have no idea what I made last night. And as y'all can see, this is the stack I made last night. Um, one of the girls actually gave me a little extra tip when we walked out. So all this goes together. And then this is what I made Wednesday night. I think I made, besides this 20, where did I get this 20 from? I don't know if somebody came in or what. but Or I ended up was like able to transfer. Like, what's not the words? Not transfer exchange some bills but i think i ended up making 24 dollars on wednesday but the way that my uh, money that i needed to turn in was like over 50 cent if it's over 50 cent you know we round up we don't give out change so i think i made 24 dollars but one of those dollars had I mean, one of those dollars went to that so i made 23 like i said i'm about to organize this and i'm actually going to change the angle of the camera so y'all can see that i we organize Well, it wasn't really too much to organize because I did get it in order last night. It's going to be the fun part is going to be to count. So I want to show you all the stack one more time. I'm going to let everybody kind of guess and whatever what y'all think this is. Kind of do some like updates while I'm counting a little bit. I know once upon a time, like I said, I did used to ask everybody to kind of like inbox me questions or ask comments or like leave comments on like, some of my older videos about anything that they wanted to know and like i said i just haven't done this in a long time i haven't done this in years just because i was taking a little turn on my channel i didn't want it to be all about the club life or anything but this is part of it my channel is about lifestyle so this is part of my lifestyle it's one of my sources of income and you know i was cool i don't i don't it is what it was y'all i don't know how many ones this is i'm gonna go a smooth 80 Eight, I'm gonna go smooth 80. I'll smooth 80. So my goal when I go to work, um, since like I said, I really work on the weekends. I usually work Fridays and Saturdays. My goal per se is $100 a night. So every two, every week, I should bring home $200 or so. That is for me. Um, I know typically most people always ask like, what about hours? Our hours of operation is 8 p.m. to 2 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. I guess it doesn't really matter because it's 8 to 2. 
Of course, I know some of the back ends for the girls and dances and stuff like that, but that's not what this video is about. That's a, maybe a, maybe another video. Maybe another video. That's for, oh, I think some somebody before had asked me, did do I make just tips? I don't make just tips. I do make an hourly wage, and I was able to get a requested increase, and I got an increase on my hourly wage. I think once upon a time, if you watch my video from like two years ago, I'll leave the link up here in the cards. If you watch that video from like two years ago, I was making eight dollars an hour. I don't know if I even really said that, but I was making eight dollars an hour. But I did it requested increase, so I make more than that now. But let's stop yapping and get to counting. So I'm going to show you how the spread looks on the floor or what I just counted. Alright, so this is how everything looks on the floor right now. Y'all see Wednesday over there with the 20 on top. Um, I got five stacks of ones and a stack of five and a stack of tens. Y'all see me calculate and I calculated everything right. Um, so last night I made a... What did I just calculate? $142 is what I made last night. So like I said, on average I try to make $100 a night. As y'all see, Wednesday was super slow, so I only made. So 23 plus 142 is 165, which is great. Technically, on any other day, I would only need, what, like 25, 35 bucks to make my $200 goal. But since I have one more night, which will be tonight, and I'll be bringing you guys along with me, you guys are going to see how tonight is going to go. I don't know if I'm going to try to talk in between because they do play the music, of course. And, you know, I don't want any copyrights, so I don't know what, what we're going to actually talk or hear, but I, I don't know if we're going to actually talk, but I will show y'all an overview of everything. Um, like I said, y'all don't ever have to worry. I know somebody else asked me that, like, <sighs> all right, I guess let's get into the nitty gritty while we get everything organized. And how it usually works is I keep... I'm going to keep these ones separate because this was not a full stack. This is now only $15. So yeah, this was only $15. And these four, the other four that y'all saw are air 20. So this is the 20, this is the 20, 20, and 20. So I did make $92 last night in just ones. And I did say, I thought it was a smooth 80. So I was kind of close. I have gotten pretty closer understanding and eyeballing um that's that i'm gonna end up taking these ones back to work and exchanging these for bigger bills and then at the end of the week which will technically be tomorrow we will do um i'll do one more bill exchange tonight while i'm at work because i don't want to bring home all these ones so i might end up taking these 15 to work but i'd like to try to keep some Enough rambling in this video. I don't think I've answered technically all the questions that I usually have all the time. I did answer um, hours of operation. I do answer. I did answer like my pay rate. Technically, how you know, like I said, I do get the hourly wage and also the tips. Dress code. It's really supposed to be the way the, the one of the assistant managers wanted to put it to me. It's supposed to be sexy, business, casual, baby. I wear whatever I want to wear. Okay. I, want, I have worn a sweatsuit before. I just try not to wear a sweatsuit. Um, I wear leggings. I wear jeans. I wear my Uggs. I wear Crocs. I wear cute shirts, crop tops, t-shirts, sweatshirts, sweaters. You know, I say for real, it's just more or less like dress what fits you, what fits your personality and whatever like that. That is really the disclaimer I will give about how you should dress for the club. Secondly, or like about dress code, um, I wouldn't say you don't have to necessarily walk in heels. I would just say, you know, comfortable shoes at most because nobody actually sees you. They really just see you waist up unless you go inside and like do bill exchanges or anything like that. Um, but most people, like I said, I kind of built my repertoire in there. So when I tell somebody like I want to come inside and find you for your ones, like best believe I'm going to come inside and find you for your ones. I don't like being hounded at the door, but if you can see... Some of the people who do see where I either call for ones at the door and I run out or B, um, let's see, it's kind of just busy at the moment and they don't mind like me bringing it to them. A lot of the people that we have are really cool. So you build your repertoire. 
you kind of do what you want to do. You make the rules, you call your shots at your door. That's what I do. Um, yeah, so that's that. Billy Exchange, dress code. This is that in the third. That's really it, you know what I'm saying? If that were you and you were me, I would not keep a lot of money in my house or, like, keep a lot of money on me person. I do, um use my money to create a paper trail because for example i guess this is one of the things that i was talking about when i said we we're going to do it tomorrow when we talk to the bank but i use my money to make a paper trail um because i like to put it into the bank that's why i like to do my exchanges and then i like to put it in the bank because when you start trying to get houses apartments cars whatever like that they need bank statements they need proof of income so if you're able to make deposits and you know obviously what you do with your work is what you do. It is, you are an independent contractor. You make your own money. So I will say, if you want to have a good night, then you got there and you have a good night. If you feel like you're not in the mood, then you skip work. It's up to you, personally. But, yeah, like I said, y'all don't have to worry. This is all going to be gone tomorrow. Y'all will ride with me tomorrow to get rid of this junk. But until tomorrow, oh, literally until later, I'll see, talk to you guys later. Okay, y'all today is Sunday so it is the last day of well it was yesterday was my last day of my work week so we got some funds we need to count so I think I'm gonna get we'll go ahead and organize this I did do a bill exchange as y'all can tell I definitely did a bill exchange last night since I wasn't gonna I'm not going back until Friday I don't want to be sitting on all those ones so I ended up turning them in so I turned in the ones that y'all see me have yesterday which was 80 and by the time I finished last night um, it was really 92 but it was 80 that I could exchange um, for one for 20s and then last night I actually had another 60 at least that I could exchange for 20s last night so let's see what we got last night on Saturday Saturday was actually pretty weird it started off really really slow apparently we have rich homie Kwan here last night all right yeah and i didn't know that y'all i'll be not in the loop at all so that's that's for the here nor there so i'm gonna actually organize all this money from last night and then i'm gonna count it and then we're gonna count the grand total because this was from friday from wednesday and saturday oh i gotta get I mean, wednesday and friday i gotta get the other bills that i did exchange last night out of my first two so hold on. all right so this is last night right here and you know that is wednesday and friday so we're getting ready to count this just this right here and y'all know my goal is to make over a hundred dollars a night so let's see if we made over a hundred dollars last night i do know we at least made 60 because we had to exchange some of the ones so 20 40 60 20 so this is 120 30 40. so we made 152 last night we like that so now let's add them all together and i don't remember what we made i think i've been telling y'all throughout the the week or the days yeah the week so if y'all remember go ahead and drop the comment below before i uh started counting because i don't know so i had to make at least what like 200 dollars this week let's see what we got so what did i say so 317 is what we should have calculated we're gonna count it one more time, but 317 is what I think I got. Did y'all count that with me? Did I get 317? 17 was right. Perfect. 
perfect yep so now i need to take out six dollars because y'all don't know this but i have been doing a one dollar challenge to so i work three days this week so six dollars is coming out so here's my six it'll go into a little savings folder so we should be going to the bank and depositing 317 dollars um, i did say i was gonna bring out on the little ride with me but i think i said this in another video y'all know how to make a bank deposit so we're not even finna go do that I'm going to see you guys in the next video, which will probably be dropping next week if I don't forget. You want me to take the tag out? Do you want me to take the tag out? <laughs> Anyways, I'll see you guys in the next video.